The Olympics are currently being hosted in East London, and that appears to also be the destination for Andy Carroll, after a shock loan move was agreed by Liverpool from West Ham for the forward. The Hammers will pay out £2 million to take the England international on a season-long loan. That could result in a £17 million transfer if West Ham stay in the Premier League. Carroll, seeking to regain the form he had back in Newcastle, would prefer to prove himself with Liverpool rather than make the switch to Upton Park permanent. Tim Cahill has been paraded as the latest signing by MLS club the New York Red Bulls. The Australian playmaker, who has been instrumental for Everton the past eight years, admitted he was saddened to leave the Toffees, but relishing the challenge of playing in the USA. As a footballer, I suppose I've, uh, I've achieved a hell of a lot in my career, but also I feel that um, this is a big move for me. You know, I know a lot of people might um, think otherwise, but you know, I'm 32 years old. Uh, I respect the MLS. I'm coming here at a good age. I'm fit, um, and I'm ready for a new challenge. Kale turned up to training for the first time and was immediately embraced by former Premier League star Thierry Henry. The two will hope they can form a lethal partnership this season. Now Manchester City might be looking to sign Robin Van Persie to add extra firepower up front, but if they want a clinical finisher, they'd be better off looking closer to home. Watch assistant manager David Platt, at the tender age of 46, show off his agility in training by scoring an amazing bicycle kick. With grace and athleticism, the audacious shot is a move Team GB's medal-winning gymnast would be proud of. I'm Alfred Joyner. For latest sport headlines, go to our website, ibtimes.co.uk.